Welcome back into the studio. You are listening to Ud Groove. My name is Lily Joy. My name is Sapolet. Welcome to another episode. This Wednesday we have a really, really special guest. Absolutely. It's one of a kind. It's a guru, really. It's someone who has been writing music since his existence. And his name is Awesome Lande. Welcome. He's playing. Welcome, welcome, welcome. He's playing for us right now. Very soon we're going to have a quick chat with him as well. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being here, guys. Enjoy. Wherever you are, enjoy. <laughs> Big love.
twisted now. Look how I put it down. Look how we getting down. This is for legacy. Don't get it twisted now. Look how I put it down. Look how we getting down. This is for legacy. Don't get it twisted now. Look how I put it down. Look how we getting down. This is for legacy. Don't get it twisted now. Look how I put it down. Look how we getting down. This is for legacy. Uh, Don't get it twisted now. Don't get it twisted now. We on a mission now. We on a mission now. Speakers are getting loud. loud. This is for legacy. Uh, I don't pretend to be nah. something that isn't me. Uh-uh. I just be doing me. Me, me. I got a whole new style. Stop. I'm about to get real wild. Wow. Oh yeah, I'ma go off on this. Uh. Oh yeah, think of that getting sick. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you better get your fix. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, we about to get so lit. lit. Yeah, 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 I'ma go off on this. Uh. Yeah, yeah, you better uh. get your fix. Wow. This is for legacy. Uh. Don't get it twisted now. Ooh. Look how I put it down. Ooh. Look how we get it down. Ooh. This is for legacy. Yeah. Yeah. Don't get it twisted now. Hey. Look how I put it down. Yeah. Look how we get it down. Ooh. How I'm flipping now. We on mission. We all kings. We all gods. We all sing. Watch me move. I get busy. I get busy. Use a fool. I'm a panther. Black. What? Kinda. Ever. Respect. Oh, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Give me my, give me my dividends. Look at that. Look at this. Everything. My, my That's right. Look at that, look at this, have a dance. Yes. Come on, come on.
Housewives Choice every Sunday morning from 10.30 to midday. With your hosts, Miss V and Bellies. As we take you on a virgin excursion. Playing the best in reggae, dance hall, roots and culture. To keep your Sunday session moving in the right direction. Right here on KISS FM Australia. Looking to advertise for your business or event? Support local. Support KISS FM. Why have your advertising lost in the endless feed of social media wasteland when KISS can deliver an enthusiastic and receptive audience who value businesses that value and support KISS FM? Unlike social media, our advertising cannot be skipped, so our adverts get heard. Unlike street posters, KISS FM adverts have a long campaign period that cut through at very affordable prices. So talk to Timmy Byrne by emailing timmy at kissfm.com.au and get results when you want brand awareness and or a call to action. Keep it real, keep it cost effective and keep it front of mind by advertising with Kiss FM. Kiss FM helps to support the dance music scene by informing our captivated community about what's on. Dance music events, clubs, festivals and live stream events. So here's a reminder to add the Kiss community to your free marketing plan. We don't populate our event listings. It's got to come from the community. Submissions come from the community and the industry. Join them in connecting to the Kiss community who love going out and doing things. Other events we're happy to support are charity or not-for-profit fundraisers, arts and artist exhibitions, performances, food and fashion events, markets, all kinds of things of interest. Bring it on. Submit. It's free. Your event listing at kissfm.com.au Did you miss your favourite Kiss FM show? Well, we've got you covered. Kiss FM has partnered with Mixcloud to provide all our shows on demand 24 hours a day. So you never miss a Kiss show again. For more info, check out kissfm.com.au forward slash kiss on demand. Kissfm.com.au Dance Music Australia. Welcome back. Welcome back. You're listening to Earth Groove. My name is Lily Joy. My name is Apalet here. And today is a very extraordinary day, actually, for us, for, for this incredible radio show that has been created almost a year ago to share um, about music, to share about producers, to connect people to activities and principles we stand for. And today, as I'm saying this, I'm literally getting goosebumps because the person I'm about to introduce, it's, it's, it's more than just a musician. You know, it's a stand for the world with very incredible and amazing energy. It's here to really make a difference, and he does it with every single action in his life. His name is Oslande. Thank you for being here. Thank you for having me. We are truly touched uh, you for your know, presence. Thank you for the first half an hour of music you, uh, no, you gifted pleasure. us. It was insane. The energy in the radio was <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, it's it's always so good to be here. You know, like I was saying earlier, Australia is my true home. You know, the people and uh, I don't know, everything here just works for me. My spirit is closer here. Well, I oh, beautiful. As, yeah. as you're saying this, I actually want to acknowledge the original custodians of this land and uh, always pay respect to uh, oldest yep, and the new yeah. Yeah. and uh, we are here to make a difference and uh, I guess uh, when I think of uh, someone like you with uh, your background and when you started your, your gift actually you started so early at yeah. so early age at the age of eight you wrote your first song uh, about 12 I started playing piano at seven uh, I think I wrote my first song full song about 12 12 years old but uh, yeah I knew music was my my thing I told my dad I wanted to play piano and he had a piano the next week and I was in class this uh-huh. is yeah. this is when the vision of your <laughs> life destiny was yeah. born, isn't well, it? Well, actually, it's funny because my father was a baseball coach and he wanted me to play baseball. So I did one year of baseball. I hated it. <laughs> and then I told him, okay, piano. And he says, okay, I'm never going to push my dream on you, whatever you want. And uh, Yeah, so 12, he gave me my first synthesizer, which was a Cork Poly 61. And wow. I started writing music with the two tape, two cassette decks, dubbing yes. over dubbing. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how I started. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Recording I was the only it? child, so... 
I didn't have a lot of friends. It was just me and the uh, and, and your music. Yeah, me and the music. And in, in St. Louis, um, all the houses have basements for the tornadoes. So oh. I, I, my house, my room was always the full basement. So oh. when I was grew up, we, oh, had, we had many bands, and so all the bands would leave their equipment at my house to rehearse. So when they would leave, I would learn how to play everybody's part because the instruments were there. Oh, so that's how I basically lucky, yeah. Yeah, listening by by ear, playing music that I like. And, um, and do you still have those 12 years old recordings nowadays? No, <laughs> you know what? I, I I was living in Greece for about 11 years, and everything of mine was robbed. Oh, oh no, no. Yeah. So <gasps> well. It's okay, you know. Less Whatever in your heart. Less things on my back, more further I can walk. Exactly. Y you're learning the art, yeah. the, the well, art of letting go. Yes. 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 So it's okay. That's fantastic. Yeah, it happened. It's in the spirit somewhere. Mm -hmm. And I know something well, quite incredible because we all grew up kind of in that uh, age, time, age, uh, time zone. Let's call it Sesame Street. Yeah. <laughs> we know you you wrote the. the I wrote some music there, some but music you know it's there. funny. This this is like one of the things that always comes up. Uh, I was living. I just moved from St. Louis to LA for um, just for a trip. My father, um, I moved out of my house when I was 16. And so my father was um, trying to make amends with my family because I was like, ah, I'm 16, I'm on my own, whatever. He said, okay, I, want, I know you like the music thing. Let me send you to LA and blah, blah, blah. So he sent me to LA. Anyway, I, I was working with Tony Basil who did a, oh, Miki, you're so fine, you're so fine. Yes. I was living with her for about three months and We were working on some things, and basically, I just made some some beats, and she was choreographing for Sesame Street, and also Devo, Bette Midler, and all these other things. And she just used the stuff that I, I did. I never went to Sesame Street. I never met anyone. Never, you know. But it's still one of those things that comes up a lot. But it's interesting. Me as a black man in America, we we never watched Sesame Street. I, I didn't. We watched Electric Company. Oh. Which was like the multiracial, <laughs> you know, like Mexican, Japanese, black, yeah. every kind of kid, and it was like the songs were funkier, and yes, so. Yeah. It was interesting, like every interview was like Sesame Street. I'm like, wow, I didn't, I never Still grew coming. up knowing how big of an impact that was for people around the world. Around the world. Because for us black kids, we didn't, we didn't watch it at all. <laughs> never at all. But yeah. It happened. Right place, right time. Yeah. 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 Well, now that you point out um, <laughs> your time in LA, um, wasn't like a few years after when you uh, released your first album with the Interscope Records? Uh, well, uh, yeah, I produced my first. Yeah. Well, yeah. not my. Well, it was my first. Yeah, yeah, yeah my yeah. first. So I was 17. I was producer uh, Rico Suave. What was the uh, inspiration or the message behind you know that what? album? It was. It was again right place, right time. So from Tony Basil, I met all these all the guys that were in Breaking. So the movie Breaking and all those guys uh -huh. because she was choreographing and dancing with these guys. So I knew all of the dancers in LA. I knew all the guys that was in the movies, all of the videos. Wow. Yes. And all of them wanted to be singers. Yeah. <laughs> all of them wanted to be singers. So they would hire me to produce their music. Oh yeah. wow! That's how I survived in LA. <laughs> Oh, All these dancers, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Gerardo was one of those guys, and he was in uh, he was he was in a lot of films, and so he basically we did a four track recording of Rico Suave. Rico Suave, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to ask you about that. And he went to Acapulco to film a movie, and he hired the film crew for one day to do the video. Yes, came back, he had the video, and I was working with. Um, um, Uh, uh, Michael um, Michael Cimbello. I don't know if you know Michael Cimbello. Uh, Maniac. She's a maniac. Yeah, of course. Who was also the guitarist for Stevie Wonder. No. Yes, yeah, so wow. I was working in a studio. 17-year-old wow. black guy in L.A. working wow. with these guys wow. in a studio wow. with Bobby Caldwell. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, so, you know, Bobby Caldwell. Uh, what you won't do, do for love. Oh, so, wow. So my engineer was the engineer for all of these guys. 17 years old? 17 years old. Oh, so my he would, God. He would take me. Bobby Caldwell hated me because he would take me to Bobby Caldwell his house and give me the I need, I need a synthesizer oh let's go Bobby has this synthesizer so Bobby would hate me he's like why is this black guy have my age? <laughs> not black guy like that but you know yeah but yeah so I was surrounded by all of these great guys and so I took um, the four track to Michael Cimbello mm -hmm. who knew Jimmy Ivey who was just starting Interscope so it was the first record on Interscope wow yeah so that's how that started but I didn't see what a, a big starting what I a beautiful memory yeah uh, not so beautiful I didn't see a penny of that because <laughs> I'm 17 and I was in the music business I knew fuck yeah. all and it was just like sorry but yeah it wasn't a good experience on that side but yeah it was a, it was a great introduction to the, the business and from there I just kind of you know network myself and start producing for other people and 
Yeah, and then I burnt out of that and said, okay, the music business, that part of it is not for me. Okay, so that's, what, what where, my next, there, yeah. that's, that's where my next question yeah. comes. Uh, so then I moved to New York. Uh, there you go. Yeah. And um, and Yoruba started. Um, um, yeah, Yoruba. I, 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 when I left the music business, I found uh, Yoruba, uh, or Yoruba found me found or whatever. You. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I became a priest and, uh, and uh, yeah, changed my life. And so I was going out a lot to the clubs after um, my, you know, hibernation time, I guess you would say, and listening to people like Ron Trent, Louis Vega, Joe Cossell, and all these, all these um, producers that were using live instrumentation, Brazilian instrumentation, yes. African stuff. And I was like, oh, the rhythm. Well, yeah, and I'm coming from the commercial the, pop yeah, stuff of yeah, the majors. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. like, oh, yeah, this, like, is what what is this, yeah, like, yeah. this is what I want to do. Yeah, this is what I want to do. But I knew that I wanted to have something from the culture of the Yoruba culture. So I wanted something from the diaspora, which I think is is um, common in all um, indigenous cultures, is call and response. Okay. You know, you have the call leader and singer response. and the, yeah. the tribe's response. Yes. And that wasn't something that, like now you hear it a lot. She's quite uh, uh, quite used in the gospel music as well? Yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. exactly, yeah. So that theme, I, and no one was doing that. And I said, okay, so that's going to be my, my first. So that's how Yoruba started. That's my thing. I met uh, Tommy Musto. Um, who had um, a distribution company um, in New York and he said you want to start a label I said yeah so we went into business together yeah back in the days when we were selling like 10,000 records <laughs> of release like what, what, what's yes, happening I release yeah. music yeah so I got a lot of support from from the DJs in New York like playing my music and then I started doing a lot of remixes for me I think that's what catapulted me I just took every remix I could get and that kind of got my name out the UK guys start calling me the French guys start calling yeah. me and then I started getting DJ bookings And, mm. and then the funny thing was I was I never really I was DJ, I was always able to DJ I DJ like hip hop stuff when I was yeah. a kid or whatever but it's funny when I got my first DJ gig it was I was on um, when I released my album my first actual house album um, Paradigm I was in London and I got a call to do a gig with Harley and Muscle and they're like oh man we got you're in you're in London and you got some records we can come play I was like are you gonna play you gonna pay me to play some records oh, <laughs> word <what>? okay <laughs> let's go oh, it's like two hundred fifty dollars like, fuck let's yeah. go yeah, <laughs> yeah. So this is, this is, this is, yeah because y'all come from oh, playing bands where it's like you know I was like well, I'll pay you play there yeah, so that's uh, that's totally changed you know it's like that's been the the for, forefront of how I how I survive and just you, to connect with the people as well you're just a man of million talents uh, I just have been uh, fortunate to choose the right paths before I arrived here I think that's it yeah you know? and, and reconnect with the people and the, and the spirits that were joined to to make my, my, my journey a little bit uh, and uh, easier I think and not easier because it hasn't been easy but it's been knowledgeable you know I think I've I've, uh, I've learned through age just to take real pride in what I do and and just be honest with everything and allow my vulnerabilities vulnerabilities and just the knowledge of what I see and not what I hear you know I mean not what I hear but You know, just like kind of like you see everything that's going on in the world, but you have your own spiritual view of how you connect with it. What things make you feel like that's my truth. Like if something doesn't feel right to me, my spirit doesn't say, no, this is not my reality, yes. you know, or, you know, to lead. And it does take courage, you know, to stand for what it, you believe. It, it takes a lot of courage, especially when you, when, you have people, when you have people looking at you. It's definitely, it's it takes it. courage. And, you know, and, and I've lost fans for my, my views and my posts. And, it, you know, but I think the, the, the main thing that we all need to understand and realize is that we all have views, but we all have spirits. And if, if I think if you really, really know yourself and you connect within and you go, okay, wait a minute. Yeah. I don't have to question anything. I just have to feel how does this vibration make me feel? If I don't feel at ease and at peace with how this is going, then it's not mine. It's not for me. Yeah. And so yes. that's 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 my that's my only um, thing here. Um, just for everybody to kind of live their own reality and, and truth and and be strong enough to not be influenced by all of the um Mm -mm. The, the toxic society celebrity making, you know all of these things feeding it's, people it's, into boxes and yeah, yeah, it's, just, creating it's really harmful it's really harmful yeah. I think we've lost we've lost the nature of, of humanity we're losing the nature of humanity and it's important and that's where music comes well, in well but know? I tell you what until people like yourself exist in the world yeah 
we're not gonna lose it. No, 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 we won't lose it. We won't you lose know, it. you, you, you are a light worker, and that's yeah. the first time I've met you. I didn't even need to actually meet you. I just had to listen to your music and to yeah. your sound. And but that's the thing. And I've seen, I've seen what you're doing. You're a light worker, and until people like you, like us, standing up for the world and standing up to make a difference, yeah. we until we are here, yeah. nothing is lost. Yeah, no, no, no. no. Yeah, we're because not the lose. world works no, in we, perfect we, balance we between here and there. You know, we. We are here. We and are resilient. Are. And yes, and we, we are resilient. Are, we are resilient, and we are we are strong, and we're getting stronger and more awake and more more wise, and our vibrations and the frequencies are going faster, and we're we're acknowledging self more and more. And uh, yeah, the music for me is just how I connect. You know, I want to channel from whatever they give me just to ev all of That's us. That's your universal to, to, language. To heal all of us and yes. to leave a, a stage yes. or a dance floor and go. Okay, yes. that, I'm better now. You know, yes. if I do that, I'm fine. And you did that. <laughs> yeah. You did that last yeah. last week yeah, at Festival yeah. 23, yeah, and yeah. that was extraordinary. That's wow! wow. <laughs> We're like, wow! That was the best sunset set ever. It's, it's just yes. that you know, it's just that giving giving up and just going. Yeah. Okay, what are you gonna give me? What do I? What do we yeah. need? What do we need now? What song? Yeah. Do elevate we need the spirit. To, to, elevate. to move us here. Yeah, yeah. And you play all the genres. Yeah, you everything. Know, yeah, everything. Yeah, I I've to, heard yeah, Balkan yeah. music. Yeah, yeah. And I'm Balkan. Yeah, shake it, shake it, shake it. Melbourne, Mike Steva. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, yes. No, you, you, you know. I think you have to go everywhere because there's so many different vibrations that move us. And I think my gift is I know I, I don't know. I challenge the task of rhythm making with things that shouldn't exist but they fucking go Dude. really good together yes. so i'm like oh what is that gonna sound like with this oh i don't know but let's just do it yeah and you know it's like okay well that's really techy or well, that's really vocally or whatever but it's also the emotions oh you're in the dance floor you need yes. those things to to go sometimes you're just like okay now i need yes. to have five minutes just yes. like yeah right. i just need to do the two step yes. then i need to just go yes. out and just you know, <laughs> put my arms up you know? for you it's so like playing jazz with the decks yeah yeah no i'm i'm it, if i, I have totally, to i have to party totally. with myself i'm like music is, is my life it's my therapy i have to party with myself you have to party with I myself yeah yeah, yeah yeah that's a really good yeah. saying i can't watch a dj that doesn't move i'm like how am i supposed to move if yeah. you're not yes energy what's going on here exactly we 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 run there were some DJs that they, I don't know if you saw the guy before I was saw so many DJs it was like so I was like yes, yes let's oh, get this party yeah. so let's look at me they look like oh my god Anya yes, yes. killed it Anya yeah, yeah, like, killed it okay that was like yeah, yeah. Here we go. when I got on the energy yes. was already there yeah that's it yes. Yes. that's the thing you know and uh, I think yeah we, we feed off of the connection and that's the music it. yeah yeah Thank you so much. Yeah, my pleasure. For this quick chat. In the next break, we're going to talk about what's coming next also for Osolande yeah. and for his adventure here around Australia and around the world. He's going to be touring with us. And uh, um, we also have a few gigs coming on. Yeah. And we're going to talk about this uh, very soon. In the meanwhile, actually, while we're here, um, we just want to remind you guys that um, we are streaming live from Kiss FM. Kiss FM is an independent radio that exists just thanks to people like uh, you guys for $55 a year. You can become sign up, member. become a member yes. and make a difference and allow us, the underground music scene, to continue existing in this amazing town and around the world and Let's keep continue it hosting beautiful people like, yeah, what's that, like a, few, a, few, a few pints, come on. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> come on. So we That's love you guys. Love we Thank you so much. A year of good so music, much. a few pints, come on. Yes. Yes. Support, support. Support, yeah, support exactly. underground music scene. Yes. Well, so thank you again. Thanks again for being here yeah, for pleasure. sharing thank your you. music yeah. and your message i think thank that's you. the most beautiful thing yeah. inspiring for the world thank you Very. thank you thank, thank you, you. Thank all right you, well this is el de groove
Sky High Mount Dandenong is one of the Dandenong Ranges' most beautiful and truly unique wedding and special occasion venues. Our wonderful food, superb views, beautiful gardens and team of experienced professional staff ensure that your special day will be a dream come true. As one of the top Mount Dandenong Wedding Range venues, we guarantee an incredible experience. Check skyhighmountdandenong.com.au for details. Dance Music Australia. Studio with our very, very special guest for today, Oson Lade. What an incredible honor of the headlining Festival 23. He's here with us in Melbourne for a couple of more weeks, moving around the country as well. Huge, huge event coming up this Saturday. Make sure you're there. Oson Lade, it's playing in the Chasers this Saturday night. Very soon we're going to talk more about details. But just mentioning that for you guys, for whoever is staying in Melbourne this weekend, don't miss out of Awesome Land this Saturday at the Chasers. Thank you. 
consider myself radical. I don't consider myself militant. That's a name that is put on all the people in America who speak up for their own rights and who try to point out the injustices that go on in this country. You're immediately named a, a radical, a militant, or a revolutionary, or any other term that they choose to hang on. But I consider myself a black American mother fighting for justice for all black Americans and all oppressed people all over the world.
Kiss FM. Cable and Vision Collective presents Off the Leash a Tramp on Friday the 10th of February for a free event. Celebrating life through community, conscious connection and immersive musical experiences. Off the Leash features Sammy Lamarca, Leah Marie, Hyacinth, Jasmine Spears, back to back with Montagna Azul, U. Me, Lucho Cardona, MJK and Julie Jones. This moody, melodic, underground soundscape will be a massive 12 hour rave bringing you beats, beauty and community. For your free ticket to Off the Leash, head to the KISS FM website, gig guide and follow the the event right link. Imagine you are walking through a fine art gallery with your ears. Well, you are. Welcome to KISS FM. We are an independent, low-powered, unfettered transmitter of the best dance music in the world. We're open 365 days a year, 24-7. You come in and out as much as you like. We know many of you are here every day. You may have just finished in the techno gallery. You can find the chill-out section just beyond the house music all-night-long exhibition. And don't forget, if you do forget, you can go back with KISS On Demand. Now, you might visit an actual gallery once or twice a year and you know when you're there it's a special place i just want to remind you that this is a special place and space that you have found with us the custodians of galleries do everything they can to get you in to see these amazing artists your fee covers that incredible responsibility by the gallery to show the artist to expose the artist to do the utmost to make sure the artist is recognized by the world around them custodians of galleries are not capitalist profit making types they're not always artists but they take massive risks to support artists and the public who yearns for culture. This is the gallery of KISS FM. Welcome again. Please become a KISS member. It's $55 a year, working out to just over $1 a week. We need you. I am Kate. I am one of the custodians. If you can, please become a member. It's that big disco everybody's talking about. Tune in for some funky disco tunes on the Dance Tour Show on KISS FM, Dance Music Australia. Oh my gosh, the music just turns me on. Turn on between 1.30 and 3 o'clock on a Sunday afternoon for some funky disco tunes on KISS FM, Dance Music Australia. Kissfm.com.au Dance Music Australia. Australia. And and we are back into the studio with our very special guest, Osolande. I have to say, um, it's been just an extraordinary journey so far. Uh, me and Apolette, both of us, we're feeling like so blessed and blown away. We were earlier hugging what a boogie. the show. <laughs> what a boogie, Lily. Yes. <laughs> we're like, wow, yes. what an energy. Good, good, good Wednesday boogie. Good Wednesday yeah, yeah. boogie. Good and again, thank yeah. you so much oh, from, from the bottom of our hearts oh, for great. being here. You woke me up today, so yeah. Yes. Good. yes. Yeah. And um, we are here to talk about actually uh, your upcoming shows. Uh, yeah, so we have uh, Moser room. Moser bar? Moser yeah, room. Moser there bar. is a Moser room Moser in the Chasers, in the Chasers. this Saturday, 11th yeah. of February. Don't miss out of it. Please jump online. You can find the event on our official, official Kiss FM website page. Mm-hmm. Um, 11th. Then you have another upcoming show on the 17th in Adelaide. In, in, Adelaide, yeah. in the Thirsty uh, Tiger. Thirsty Tiger. Yeah. Yeah. Tiger. yeah, with Oisima, Planet Self, uh, my boy Johnny, uh, Joffy, uh, yeah. And Cassie, yeah, it's gonna be fun. And my then, little family down there. And then I know about the third show, which third hasn't been an, an announced. Hasn't been announced. We're gonna announce next. Okay, so, okay. Week, so we, it's a third show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's a third uh, show. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Which, uh, which I know is someone uh, named Lily Joy will be playing, maybe. Uh, maybe. Maybe get you over there somewhere. In my yeah. Yes, yes, yes. And uh, yeah, same with, I think, uh, the 18th as well. I think yeah. we're going try to try to make that happen. Based upon you guys buying the tickets for this Friday, guys, we'll, we'll sure. do it again. It'll be my last round before I leave the country. So we get to see everybody that did make it to the festival to come out and do the side parties with us. Absolutely, guys. Make sure you're checking out Osulande this Saturday night. And Apolet, what is on your calendar? Yeah. Well, in my calendar, I'm doing a special debut, debut this Sunday. Mm. I'm playing at Revolver for the first time in a oh, Sunday. Wow. Yeah, 
Okay. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. I'll, I'll be warming up. <laughs> you gotta do it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I, I played already once there, but never in a Sunday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. That's the right day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it is. And, well, I also wanted to mention very quick, there is a very special event happening in Melbourne. Uh, there is a brand new shop opening of Bounce Audio. Bounce Audio. It, yes, in Chapel Street. Yes. So, wow, it's looking amazing. High Street, number 201. It's 201 Chapel yep. Street in Praram. So make sure you come very soon to Make have sure you check it out. Actually, check tomorrow, out. tomorrow, Miss Farina is playing for the opening. Yeah, tomorrow is the intimate opening, but intimate from opening. Friday is opening to, to everyone. And yes, yeah. looking Keep, great, good yeah. music. I saw one of your records there this uh, morning. Nice. So yeah, there nice. you go. Yes. We, we should, make we it should go there. inside. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yes. That's a really yes. good idea. I haven't, so done, I haven't done vinyl shock me yet, so maybe there you go. Do yeah, we'll ah, do that. It's yeah. the perfect Please yeah. come for the opening yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, tomorrow. Yes, done. yes. Done that's deal. it. Yeah. Amazing. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. Good. Just text me the details. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, I'll bring perfect. back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> from, there, from there, I'm actually going to go straight to the airport yeah. as I am flying to New Zealand. I'm going to be playing at Shipwreck Festival over the weekend, an extraordinary festival with an incredible community. It's a proper festival, do amazing people coming together in a community vibe bringing and elevating human race to the next level as they are there to truly share one another and make a difference uh, so I'm looking forward to warm up at main stage uh, for Devota, an artist nice. I love a lot and uh, looking forward to do all the workshops and all the intellectual talks uh, because for me festival it's also that side and um, to wrap it up uh, yeah. we just want to we just want to ask also Lande what would you what would you wish to our listeners from this new year uh, I, I just wish for everyone to slow down and um, be internal and um, not be so distracted beautiful beautiful yeah. thank you so much Pleasure. thanks once again yeah. have a lovely day thank, thank you for you joining well. us yeah. thank you Pleasure. that's been extraordinary yeah, that's thank fun. you again thanks for having me. special guest I'll I'll again the next time I'm here yes yeah, yeah. please yeah, that yeah, would yeah. be phenomenal yeah. please make we'll sure we're together check it out. yes yes <laughs> we do this we're back going to back. burning magic <laughs> yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes oh, love you nice. yeah. thank well, you again thanks to everyone for listening today as well thank you guys yes you're gonna keep enjoying for the next 20 minutes yes what you have in the fall there, isn't there for us? Uh, let's see what's going on from which yeah. way. Yeah. See what's happening. Thank you. Thank you for we'll sharing. We'll see what's cracking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> keep Thank you guys for the groove. Big love. Big, I'll talk big to you love. next Wednesday, yes. 2 to 4 on Kiss FM.
seems twice as old. With clothes torn and dirty. Give him a job shining shoes or cleaning out toilets with bus station crews. Give him six children with nothing to eat. Expose them to life on the ghetto street. Tie an old rag around his wife's head. Have her pregnant and lying in bed. Stuff them all in a Harlem house. And then tell them how bad things are down south. Paint it black.
This is a poem of thanks, a poem of celebration, a celebration of life, a life full of boundaries, yet riddled with choices to abound them. So let's celebrate life. Let's give thanks to the motherland, for it is from our breast that we drink the sweet milk of life. Thank you.